Let's go to bed. You're working at the shop from tomorrow onward, right? Oh, right. Today's Valentine's Day. No wonder there were so many guys bringing girls in here. Don't you have anything exciting happening? I mean, you've been here nearly a whole year. You know, when I was young. <laughs> oh, boy. Good evening. Should I come back later? Oh, uh, you should have just told me. Here, I'll leave the store to you. Enjoy yourselves. You seem to be doing well. Sure. Sure. It's nice to see you again. You don't look like you've got any issues. Really, I can't relate. Suicide in jail, then New Year's in the reformatory? Ex post facto isn't exactly gonna cover this, you know? I can always give you a more thorough checkup. But before that, suicide in jail, then New Year's in the reformatory? Ex post facto isn't exactly gonna cover this, you know? That's my line. Suicide in jail, then New Year's in the reformatory? Ex post facto isn't exactly gonna cover this, you know? Honestly, can't take my eyes off you for a second. Honestly, can't take my eyes off you for a second. But I guess I'd better get to the point. Here. Chocolates. Don't worry, there's nothing too dangerous in them. In moderation, right? That new medicine for that girl I told you about has been working really well. Sadly, no. Were you hoping for that? That new medicine for that girl I told you about has been working really well. worst-case scenario, I could probably get it into prison for you. That new medicine for that girl I told you about has been working really well. And the day-to-day -day work's going fine. I'm a regular neighborhood doctor now. Thanks. Thanks. I just hoped you were safe but looks like you made it home without a scratch. Guess I had nothing to worry about. Something wrong? I see. I see. Can I sit next to you? I know that look in your eyes. You've made up your mind.
Maybe a little. Maybe a lot. I can't lie to you. By the way, something's different about you. No rush. You can hold off until things settle down a little. But if anything happens, call me. You know how to reach me. By the way, something's different about you. Hasn't been too long since I saw you last, but you've got a little more confidence now or something. Still, I guess I've changed too. As a doctor, I've still got the usual obligations to help my patients, but now I feel like I've got something a little more specific. Like, I could risk it all to make one person happy. But you're a smart guy. I don't have to draw you a picture. I was never really into younger guys. I was never really into younger guys. supposed to give chocolate to the guys they like yesterday? Hey, are you going to be okay? My gentlemanly nature is making me worry about you. Hey, what did you do? Outside the store, is that... Whoa. on in here last night. Did you think you'd just try and trick this romantically impaired fool? I was worried about you, so I came to check on you yesterday. You could have just said you were busy, even if you had to lie about what you were doing. So you already have a favorite? I came to say hello yesterday, but when I looked in the window, you were with someone else. You dick! Yesterday, who were you with? <sighs> I got worried yesterday, so I read my own fortune. It said that you're seeing someone else. You're such a problem, child. I left work early yesterday to see how you were, and I saw you with someone else. <sighs> what the heck am I doing? I got quite the scoop yesterday. A boyfriend caught cheating. I'm not very happy about it, though. You were here with someone else yesterday, weren't you? Are you cheating on me? Please tell me it's not true. I don't want to suspect you of anything, Senpai. But if something's going on, I want to know. Take it. Take my chocolate, please. Before I crush it. And here I came all this way for you. This was for you. Here, take your chocolate. You can eat this, right? It's chocolate. Here, it's chocolate, got it? Here's your chocolate. Can you eat this chocolate for me? Hey kid, say something. Are you making a fool of me? Are you making a fool of me? Are you making a fool of me? Enough of this irresponsible behavior! You're the scum of the earth! I'm disappointed. Are you being serious? Stop messing around! So not funny. This is absolutely terrible. You're terrible, Senpai. Oh, uh, I was just about to go shopping. 
Take your time. I'll see you later. If you survive. Cheer up. Here, have this. What a pain, though. I had to come up with this whole web of lies for you. I was having him help out at the store. I didn't realize it was Valentine's Day. Don't worry, he always talks about you. You're his one and only. That was enough to get you off the hook for now. But make sure your story matches mine. Got it? Yeah. <laughs>